Well, I've got a dilemma. This is my dilemma. Today, just before I went out to do work on a job, I got a phone call. Someone wanted to give me another free car. Of course, I didn't ask questions. I didn't even know what I was getting. So I said, well, I won't be home, so just drop your free car in my backyard, put the keys under the seat, and that's it. I'll be back. Well, there's what I got. A vintage 1983 Nissan Pulsar, but it's so old it's called Datsun. It's from California, from a little old lady from Pasadena, and I'm not bullshitting. It's almost rust free. It's been oiled underneath, it's got a sunroof, and most amazing, it's got air conditioning, and the air conditioning works. I just it's just amazing. 1983, 24 years old, and working air conditioning. Got one little dent in the fender there. Everything else seems fine. Interior's good. Automatic. Well, that sucks. So, to prove I'm not bullshitting, here is the original purchase paperwork. Let's see, Wendy Spurgeon. 872 Mar Engo Mar Engo Ave Pasadena She paid $8,524 plus taxes equaled a total of $9,645.30 24 years ago Cool and there's her signature. <clears throat> but all the original paperwork, the gay dinger, and 112,556 miles. Let's see if it runs. I think it does. Here we go. the air conditioning. Oh yeah, that really slows the motor down. It's coming. Man, I haven't seen one of these cars for 10 years in Canada. They all rusted away. Let's pop the hood. Sounds like it's got a little bit of an exhaust leak at the manifold. Air conditioning fans cooking away. We even got power steering. Wow, what a luxury automobile. Look at all that oily goo to prevent it from rusting. She sure looks after it. <laughs> I don't know whether to treat this car nice or to destroy it. It's a classic. Well, I guess I'm going to have to take it for a test drive and see how she handles at 100 mile an hour. Over and out for a sec. So here we go. Let's see if this thing drives. Okay. Hold the camera, son. Oh, air conditioning. Oh, luxury. Oh, yeah. Don't roll the windows up. I don't. I like the air blowing on you. Can't waste this precious air conditioning, though. This thing's like mint. Yeah. Nothing wrong with it. I bet you would just pass the safety check and keep driving it. It doesn't have anything. Well, the little exhaust leak, maybe. Oh, the seatbelt. Wouldn't want those nasty-looking police uh, charging me with 
driving this car, you know. I'll turn the air conditioning off so you can hear it. Here we go. Oh, it needs a tune up. Plug it. Plug it. Needs more power. It's like slower than my diesel van. You can tell it must be a little old lady's car. Who could put up with such low power? <laughs> Definitely my diesel van would beat this thing in a race. Let me drive now. She probably couldn't think she could make it back to California and <laughs> gave it to me. Let me drive. But it wouldn't climb the mountains. But it runs fine. I could just. I think it's a timing or a clock catalytic converter. Okay, but this is floored. I'm floored. <laughs> Carburetors suck. Floored. We're doing 45 miles an hour. Oh my god, that throttle is stuck. Oh, just a minute. Now I got unstuck. Oh, it really did get stuck. I don't think she ever pushed it to get the second barrel open before. Okay. So I went to second barrel, it got stuck. Excuse me, sir. Would you have any Geritol for a little old lady from Pasadena? <laughs> In my ancient car? <laughs> well, this, at least they give me um, almost half a tank of gas. That ought to get me across the border. <laughs> well, son. Let's go for a tour. I know you never drove such an ancient relic. Probably not. This is the kind of cars we were driving when I was making you. Sounds like it's low on power steering fluid too. Do you know how to drive? Yeah. <laughs> you haven't driven a car yet this year, have you? Yeah. Okay. Where? I don't know. At the farm probably. Yeah. <laughs> this thing is fucking shit. It just needs a tune-up and a turbocharger and a stall converter. Give it, give it a tune-up and then go pick up some chicks in it. <laughs> well, we got to share. And you got a hot, classy two-door with lots of room for bitches at back. <laughs> I'm kind of lonely, you know. Da, 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 da. Look for the parked cars. I'm not gonna hit the fucking parked car. You think I am? This thing is just a 1.5 or 1.4 liter motor. That is smaller than my diesel. Floor it. Not going fast enough. Redneck roller coaster, but it's gonna have to do. You can sell it or you can like, turn into something. I don't know, that's what's making me feel guilty. Keep it for me. I could do so much with it at the farm, but it's just such a classic relic with working air conditioning. Oh my god. And rattles and squeaks and and it's got history it's from a little old lady from Pasadena where else do you get a car like that Just, unless you're a beach boy we'll have to write a song about it <laughs>